deep in the forest of Albion, lay the small town of Oakvale, unchanged by time and untouched by the sword. Here lived a boy and his family. Come on, wake up. Daydreaming again, were you? Just like your mother, mind always wandering. Well, let it wander off to find your sister, will you? She's out playing by the Barrow Fields gate. Remember, you haven't given her a birthday present yet. Don't tell me you forgot to get her one. Well, I'm not bailing her out this time, son. Hmm. I tell you what, I'll give you a gold piece for each good deed you do around Oakvale. That should be enough to buy her a present. Now, get moving and stay out of trouble. Let me hear some good reports about your behaviour and I'll give you some money for your sister's birthday present. Let me hear some good reports. little brother. I hope you haven't forgotten what day it is, like you did last year. I'm sorry if I woke you up last night. It was another of those dreams. I was standing in this field when something happened, but I can't remember what. Never mind that though. I'm still waiting for my present. I'm just dealing with this brat. He was irritating me, playing with my sister and her stupid teddy bear. No, he won't give it to me, just because I said I'd rip his stupid head off. I told him if he doesn't do... What is it? You're... What is it? Get him off! He goes around like you...
I'm... It hurts! <laughs> Ow! Hey! I'm sorry. I'll leave him alone. Just please don't hit me again. Thank you. You stopped him good. Thank you. Here, I'll let you look after Rosie. She'll be safe with you. Well done, lad. Here's your reward for those good deeds. So, do some more good deeds and I'll give you more gold. Hello, lad. I'm a trader. I wander the world buying and selling wares, especially to fine folk like your good self. Some little girl I saw said you have a sister, and it's her birthday. And it seems you haven't got her a present yet. It just so happens that I have a rather nice box of sweets here. Guaranteed to put a smile on any sister's face for only three gold pieces. I'm afraid you just fweeg. Remember your. Isn't he just adorable? You what? Many lovely things. Get your miscellaneous items here. Honestly, where's that good for nothing? <laughs> With some woman, I don't doubt. I run his house, bring up his children, and what do I get in return? Nothing. If you find him, let me know, won't you? Where's that filthy layabout husband of mine? <laughs> I run his house. If you find him, let me... Oh, oh, thank goodness. Listen, lad, could you do me a favour? got to, you know, answer a call of nature. Oh, stay here and watch this stock for me. There's a good lad. Just I'll put a good word in for you when I get... Right, what? My cousin says that the barrels in these warehouses might have stuff in them. Quick, while he's away, smash his barrels up and see what's inside. Unless you're too scared. Unless you're just a big blubbing girl. Come on, let's go and break stuff. Are you just gonna stand there like a lemon? But being good is so boring. Wouldn't you prefer to be smashing things? Come on, there's still time before he gets back. <laughs> Oh, you're no fun at all.
Excellent. Thanks, lad. You've done me a big favour. I'll let... He'd steal your apples as soon as that year with your chores. Right, got you, you little ruffian. I've heard reports that you've been doing bad deeds. Destruction of a person's vendables. For that sort of behaviour, if you were... I'll leave it at that for now. Today, a juvenile delinquent. Tomorrow, bog... Hmm. I'm a man of my word, so here's the gold for your good deeds. But if you think that I'll turn a blind eye to your mischief, you're very wrong. Look, try to keep up. So, have you got enough money for a gift? 